The country is making a stop in the tri-state for a special one night only engagement. Harry Allen has been called the perfect jazz soloist by some critics and he's playing tonight at Cafe Vivace. And Harry joins us now along with our friend, pianist uh, Phil DeGreg. Uh, thanks for both of you coming in today. And, and Harry, let me ask you a little bit uh, about your background. Uh, you knew pretty early uh, what you were going to do. I read that you were you started playing professionally or at least uh, the hard stuff when you were in high school. Yeah, or even before that. I, I, was, I was playing gigs when I was 11, 12, 13 years old. What, what is it that you think gave you the taste for it? Uh, my father. My father uh, was a, a drummer during the big band era, and uh -huh. he, he played a lot of records around the house when I was when I was growing up, so I learned to love the music very you, early. You said, I can do that. Yeah. I can do that. Now, if a, if a man is known by the company he keeps, uh, you've kept some pretty high-profile company over the course of your career, which kind of speaks to your own talent. But talk about some of the people you've, you've played with. Well, I've been lucky enough to uh, record with Tony Bennett and Sheryl Crow, yeah. uh, the great Johnny Mandel, yeah. um, <clears throat> Hank Jones, Ray Brown. Uh, I've, I've been fortunate enough to make a lot of recordings, and I'm fortunate enough to be playing with Phil DeGregg, yep. one of my yeah. favorite piano players. Yeah. yeah, it is a pretty eclectic <clears throat> career. Are you going to play something for us today, right? We are. Okay, tell what are you going to play? We're going to play uh, I'd Like to Get You on a Slow Boat to China. All right, go ahead. Look. 